That was a tough fight. That was a really tough fight. We are struggling here, guys. Really struggling. Almost. There. I am as well. Remember. Do not harm a hair on his head. I remember. Privilege is all yours. I will stay here. If I go through that door, I will kill him. And your agreement with Hanako-sama will be undone. It you is sure? the last favor I can do for you. Yeah, I can't believe we did it. Thanks, Goro. Can't believe we actually pulled it off. Go, B. Finish what we started. Okay, here we go. Very noble. Violent delights with violent ends. Why are you lying on the floor? Where is my sister? Yeah, since he almost killed. Me and your beloved sibling. Oh, and your men almost shot and killed. She was to remain at the estate. Stay out of the way. I tried to protect her. Any danger she was in was because of you. No one else. Where is she? She'll be here. Be here. Any sec now. Till then, I'm supposed to watch you. So don't try anything. What would I try? I have tried everything. Nothing else remain. Yeah, moving the weapon. This you won't need. Just one bullet left. It's not for you. What are you going to kill yourself? Look. What do you see? Know what I see? A corporate coup that failed. Your men are out there spilling blood for no reason. Won't last long, though. Kyoto. Dubai. Paris. These people had a chance today, but they lost it. A chance? A chance for what? To forget their fear. This... Now you want to help people forget their fear by killing them? Sorry. Just don't get it. Fear? Remember, the one thing I cannot deny him. He knew how to cause fear in people. Saboro. He once told me anything of value is only a flag blowing in wind. And wind is fear. And then, you know what he did? Blew in my face. That was the one time. He was wrong. And others? He worked on them. They feared him. Even now, you saw. Idiots terrified of a dead man talking from a box. Pathetic. I would change that. If only you did not appear. You're worse than Saburo. You've no, you've no squabbles. You're happy to just kill. You are even worse than him. Saburo <laughs> ruled with an iron fist, but he didn't need a purge to hold on to power. 
power? You? You think I wanted power? Fifty years ago, terrorists blew this building into smoke. Yeah. So I heard. And? What did it give us? Not much. Nothing. But I learned lesson. If planting bombs not enough, what can you do? You become bomb. What? Hanako. Nisan. <laughs> She's brother. She didn't say you're an obu. I thank you, V. That will be all. Not all. Not yet. I will keep my end of our agreement. You will go with Helman. And you? And you? I must stay with my brother. I'm not sure I understand. Come. Time to look to your problem. Fate is a fickle mistress, isn't she? What? No. You spend your whole life fighting something, only to become that very same thing, quite literally. Is she gonna kill him? What are you waiting for? Press the damned button. Okay, here we go. I'm putting a lot of faith in you here. This can either go one of two ways. Oh shit! Is she putting Saburo's Engram into Yorinobu? Is that what she just did? Christ. So one of two things is about to happen. We're about to get shafted and we're going to die. They're going to copy our Ingram into Makoshi. And... Do to us what they did to Johnny. Or... Or, she will actually uphold her part of the bargain. I don't know. They say don't go towards the light. you now reminds me of the moment we met still see that same small time mark little thief with her head in the clouds haven't changed a bit Jesus can you stop being a prick for just a minute you know you remind me of something the Johnny of your never gave a shit 
betrayal came easy. Something to brag about. Wait, that's what you think? I betrayed you? Worse. Lots. You betrayed yourself. Her, Shoney? What do you mean by that? Biochip did more than just blend our memories. That line that kept V and Silverhand separate, well, faded a while back. I'm still here. I know what I want, and I know where I came from. I, I, I. Who's this I? You even know? I'm the V who chose to survive. I'm the V who chose to live. Same drive that kept Silverhand going his whole life. That drive and two thoughts. Never look back. Never look to those around you. Just keep moving. Look ahead. Stare death straight in the eye. You're not the only rebel around here. And I'm not the only one to have missed a bigger picture. We're a tangled web you one in the same. So if you're here to tell me something, it's because you need to hear it yourself. Yeah. I want to depart on good terms. I want to part ways on good terms, Johnny. As friends. Not sure that's possible. I'm on an operating table, getting sliced open. Our Osaka docs are taking the chip out as we speak. I mean, you knew it would end this way. That the day would come when I'd want to be normal again. Want my life back. Normal's overrated. If it exists at all, they're cutting a piece of us out. And that'll be a whole forever. That w yeah, that was the deal, Johnny. You said that when the time came, you'd give me my body back. That was the deal we made. That's seriously what you wanted. You'd go. Deal was to fight side by side, have each other's backs. And we did that. We won. Better to die on your feet than live on your knees. You sold a part of yourself, of us, to a mega corp. Was it really worth it? If you're all paranoid about being thrown in another Arasaka prison, don't be. They're gonna shred you. You're never gonna get it. It's not about Arasaka. Not even about life and death. Then what's it all about, Johnny? Enlighten me. The principle, V. It's always about the principle. Swap meat for chrome, live a BD fantasy, whatever. But at the end of it all, it's the code you live by that defines who you are. Ever get lost? It shows you the way home. Bust up into pieces? It puts you back together again. That rocker boy Silverhand's credo? Words he lived by? Something Johnny picked up from V. The old V. Stay around, Johnny. I, I don't want to drag this out. Just... See you around, Johnny. And thanks... For everything. If not for you, I'd be long dead. Several times over. You may not be happy, Johnny, but... Remember what Dex asked you? Quiet life or blaze of glory? Sure, I remember. Shame you chose wrong. Damn shame. In addition, numerous brain functions remain dormant. The neural impulses have been rerouted to the neural processor, a temporary measure. When can I expect a full report? I will send it by the end of this week. 
My congratulations again on your success. Goodbye. Please prepare the patient's room. I, I'm, I'm hearing purple. What the? The synesthesia is temporary. We had to create additional synapses in your brain. I mean, I think I'm gonna be sick. Cool. Where? Uh, what? Where's Johnny? The construct has been cleared from all engrams. The madness is past. So, we shredded him, as agreed. Having trouble remembering how I got here. Some memories you have lost permanently. Others will return in time. You must stay calm. Your neural processor is overburdened. Any unnecessary stress response will only make things worse. Emma, am I Sophie? I... I died? Twice I... I... Everything is in order. No. I don't like where this is going. I... Who am I? Please take the patient away. Notepad. Progression and its further trajectory remain unclear. Removing the tumors proved a difficult task. But the operation on the engram was the real challenge. Let's go. Is the ship of Theseus, dismantled into component parts and reassembled, oh. still the same ship? We are pioneers, the first to ever separate mentally conjoined twins. That's the question, isn't it? Yes. In Com the end... Conversation. Where do we get this from? Oh, Even the human soul. Why is it giving me all these shards? End of note. So the ship of Theseus they're talking about is like this philosophical debate about, you know, if you take something apart and put it back together again in exactly the same way, is it still the same thing, or is it something entirely new? Um, like for example, the ship in this concept is, you know, if as the wood on a ship rots and you replace it with new wood, eventually the whole boat is made out of new wood. Therefore, is it the same ship? That's the concept they're getting out of here. They've taken us apart and put us back together again. Are we still the same person? I suppose there's only... Whoa. We're in space? You're shitting me. When in Kyoto, I hear the cuckoo calling and long for Kyoto. Uh-huh. What? Please rest. A doctor will be with you shortly. I'm kind of afraid to look in the mirror, do you know that? Okay, we're s well, we're still us. We still look like us. Okay. Skipping rope. Odyssey. It's a bit long. Okay. Oh, it's so hard to know if we did the right thing. If we made the right decisions. It's so hard to know. Come here. What? Waiting for you. What? Whoa. Whoa. 
what the fuck? WNS News have been notified of a breaking story. Saburo yeah. Arasaka lives once more. Christ almighty, I cannot believe she did the that. CEO was reported dead months ago. But now it's been revealed that a copy of his consciousness was made before his death. It appears his consciousness was used to override that of his son and heir, Yorunobu Arasaka. This shocking development was revealed at a press conference earlier today. Minasan, irashi, sofu wa yoku. Kare ochita hana wa eda ni modoranai to itte imashita. Hito wa dare mo monogokoro tsuita shunkan kara死を恐れる者です。ついに人類最大の恐怖が克服されました。私、サブロー・アラサカは今息子の体を使い皆さんの前に立っています。私は勝って頼信に生を与えました。彼は愛する父のためにそれを返してくれたのです。私のいない間頼信は会社を変革しようといくつかの決定を下しましたがこれは過ちでした私の指揮のもと荒坂社は元の姿を取り戻します決して揺らぐことのない強い荒坂が帰ってくることを約束いたしますご清聴 Today is truly a historic day. Today, technology has fulfilled the promise left empty by religion. Saburo Osama, Makoto ni Omedatou. Please get ready. Testing will begin shortly. No, good morning. No, got some good news for you. We must complete a series of tests. Please do not hinder or delay. Parietal lobe examination. Please use your Kiroshi scanner and read the displayed text. And it was a sight to behold, he said, how a soul would choose its life. Sometimes pitiable, sometimes laughable. At times, wonderful and strange. That's enough. Cognitive function test. Ruby's cute. Well, solve not quite cube. a Ruby's cube. And we should be able to solve that. Hmm. No. I wasn't done. That was mean. Please link yourself to the device. Higher order representation formation, initiating test. The patient is ready to be examined. A higher order representation what? Engram surgery carries an elevated risk of the onset of personality disorder. The test is essential. What's this thing thingamajig for? It measures pupillary response. What are these tests meant to test? Initiate device calibration. Respond to the keywords. No thinking. Just the first word that comes to mind. Okay. Journey. Life. Home. The city. Enemy. Rebellion. Principal. Johnny. Johnny. Oh, she looked Betrayal. at me funny there. I don't know. Yeah, not, I didn't really feel any of those. You're in a cornfield. Tall, green plants, as far as the eye can see. The sun is bright, blinding. The stalks of corn part as you walk forward. 
you come across a clearing left by an automated combine in its wake. The heat has made your mouth dry and sticky. You spot a rodent's nest at your feet. The machine has torn through the soft soil. You spot blind, newborn field mice around their mother. The machine has left her sliced in two. Ooh. They lie in perfect symmetry, a tiny rodent rosette. Your mouth begins to water. A shadow gradually falls over the ground. The first rain cloud of the year. Hmm. Yes, right. Measurements complete. How'd I do? We will see. Motor function test. Please step onto the treadmill. Okay. We're still seeing, we're still seeing purple. Motor function test. Please connect to the device. What's this test all about? Physicality, I suppose. Please walk, gradually accelerate. How am I doing? Please control your breathing. Accelerate by three. Shit. <laughs> nice one. Get up. You can't stay here. How are we still hearing Johnny's voice? I'm having these crazy daydreams, nightmares. is going on welcome to n54 news i'm jillian jordan the world remains gripped by the revelation that saburo arasaka has returned from the dead in the body of his son yorinobu arasaka a letter of protest regarding the apparent resurrection has been signed by religious leaders human rights groups and virtue 100 company ceos this is an abomination born of unchecked vanity, technocratic arrogance, complete moral collapse. Our position is clear. Suburo Arasaka's seizure of power is in violation of international law. International arbitration is absolutely necessary to... Do we really want to live in a world where the rich and powerful can become immortal? Where they can continue to take from the poor? Not only their livelihoods, but even their bu- You are gods! You are gods! You are gods! You are gods! Line is not for trade! Line is not- But Saburo Arasaka has issued his response in similarly strong terms. There will be no appeasement. Arasaka Shanaibu no dekigoto ni kanshite. Gaibu no katagata ni toyakaku iwareru sujiai wa arimasen.性を受けることに許可が必要ない以上、蘇ることも同様であると考えるべきです。私が息子を殺めたなどという主張は事実無根。大的根拠もありません。合意の上での身体の譲与は一種の寄付に分類することができ、殺人には到底与えしません。殺
No, we are not done yet. Today we begin a new series of tests. Fine. Hit me. Let's Generally, the hardest done. pill Cognitive to swallow here test. is the fact that we allowed this, like, we caused this to happen. Solve the cube. We allowed, uh, Saburo to come back. That was, that was us. That is. Next test, please connect your personal link. I don't get what you're trying to do with the cube. Higher order representation formation. Initiating test. The patient is ready to be examined. Same thing again. Why can't I solve the fucking cube? That is what I'm trying to determine. Same thing. Again. We need very precise data. Okay. Let's start this thing. Device calibration. Please respond to each keyword with your initial association. As quick as I can, no thinking. Got it. Illness. Death. Rebellion. Johnny. I. Me. Solitude. The present. No, I don't, nothing. I don't got nothing know. for that one. The future. Nothing comes to mind. You're in a cornfield. Tall green plants as far as the eye can see. The sun is in your eyes, bright, blinding. The stalks of corn part as you walk forward. You come across a clearing left by an automated combine in its wake. The heat's made your mouth dry and sticky. You spot a rodent's nest at your feet. The machine is torn through the soft soil. You spot blind newborn field mice around their mother. The machine has left her sliced in two. They lie in perfect symmetry, a tiny rodent rosette. Your mouth begins to water. A shadow gradually covers the ground. The first rain cloud of the year. What are you trying to test with this story? Complete. We will now move on to the motor function test. Please step onto the treadmill. I don't understand. Like, I get that they're testing our personality about whether or not we're V or Johnny or whatever. But I don't get the... I don't get that story thing. Motor function test. Personal link. Really aced it last time, didn't I? Slow walk. Look, I know my body. It won't last long on this thing. The tests are necessary. They must be performed. Testing concluded for today. Communications have been unlocked. You may now phone home. Earth. Oh yeah, we had a message from... Oh, we can't open the message from Carrie? Okay. Oh. They're the only contacts we have? This is Judy. Sorry, can't answer because I'm busy packing my shit. If you don't know why, it means I just didn't want to tell you. If this is V, I'll call you. Maybe, baby. When I'm done being pissed off. Pissed off? Hey. Hey. Wow, it's been a while since I heard that voice. How's things at your end? I'm in the middle of a meeting with Mitch. He wants me to hang up. He's signaling wildly. Tell him to get lost. Tell him I said that. He says hello. To you and your venerable mother. Listen, 
I'm stuck in a shithole. It sucks. Hard. So leave the shithole. Come home. Not that simple. No is a nice word. Beautiful sometimes. You should use it more often. Sorry, Mitch is about to blow a fuse. I'll have to call you back. Neighbor? Hey. Hey, uh, bad time. Can I wait? No. Uh, not really. It's actually important. Fuck. Sorry, look, can't talk now. Gonna have to call you back. How's it going? Hey, think I ought to ask you the same. How's Misty? Well, after you left, she went off to visit her folks. For a while, most likely. Got a postcard from her, from Warsaw. There's a polar bear oh. on it. Tell her I said hi when she gets back. You'll tell her yourself. Got rid of the biochip. Arasaka do it? Yep. Sitting on their orbital station. All right. So once you get back, pay me a visit, huh? You're gonna need a thorough checkup. Yeah, so to be honest, been better. What am I supposed to do long distance over the phone? I just wanted to talk, Vic. <sighs> Look, we go back long enough that you know I'm no good at this stuff. And Misty's out of town. What am I supposed to do? Get a grip. Make a decision. You already showed yourself and me. You can do it. <sighs> Thanks for the pep talk, Vic. Sounds like a plan. Could we call Carrie? I suppose. Hey. Hey, B. Look, um, season finale of Little Big Corporal Rats is on in a minute, so, uh, call you back later, huh? Look, I need to talk to somebody. I'm sitting up in orbit and it sucks. What the hell are you doing up there? <sighs> Long story. Oh, if it sucks, come back down. Gotta wait for the end of the stupid tests. I don't have to do a thing. Just, you know, break the fuck out of there. How does okay, one do that? Okay, started. Gotta go. What if I ring Hanako? She's probably not gonna answer. No. Do I still look the same? Anything changed? Apart from our synesthesia. Whoops. What if I do just try to leave? Okay, no dice. No dice. Thought we might be able to. <sighs> I cannot shake the nagging dread in the back of my head that we have done, that we've made mistakes and we've made wrong decisions. Cannot shake that feeling. Oh, did we get our sight back? The synesthesia is gone. Everything looks normal colored now. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. What the fuck? What the f 
fuck was that? between Arasaka Corp and Militech escalated to troubling levels. Many pundits and analysts warned of a possible outbreak of armed conflict. The exacerbation of tensions was heightened when your noble Arasaka assumed leadership following his father's death and accused Militech of his murder. However, in an unexpected shift, the return of Saburo Arasaka appears to have diffused the situation between the rival mega corporations. What's ticking? Saburo Arasaka and NUS President Rosalind Myers have agreed to meet in person to lay the groundwork for a lasting peace. A first step of goodwill was taken today as the Arasaka CEO withdrew from Night City 15 armored vehicles from the company. Hey, listen. These tests gonna go on much longer. We need very precise data. I can't stand this anymore. I just want to go home. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. Respond to the key words. No thinking, just the first word that comes to mind. Loyalty. No. Want to talk to Hanako Arasaka? Please respond to each term with the first thing that comes to mind. Quick as I can, no thinking, right? Humanity. Enough! No more tests. I refuse to take any. Just want to go home. Please step onto the treadmill. No. No. As quickly as you can, without thinking about it. V. No. Cognitive function test. What is it with this cube? Solve the cube. Fuck it. Fuck. No. no, enough. I've had it. Fucking hate this place. What's ticking? There's no clock in here. I'm not entirely sure why we're trashing the place. Break the fire extinguisher. Fuck you! Fuck it, I'm just going to bed. Reckon my own room isn't gonna help anything. Dream. I have come to speak with you. 
It is an awful place. It is no wonder you are losing your mind. Come all the way here to take me home? They asked me to speak with you. Who? Who asked you? Who wanted you to talk to me? Hanako? She has forgotten you already. They called from here, from the clinic. And what did they say? They said someone should talk with you. Someone you know. I will be blunt. The surgery did not help. You will be dead before winter. How is that possible? Arsaka's got the best and brightest. No, no. The operation was a success. And that is why. But the changes the chip made were too great. Even for the corporate neurosurgeons. This is fucking Arsaka. They should figure something out. You must accept the truth. Then listen to what I say. There are options. would fix me if I helped you. You promised. I believe truly they could. Said you had powerful friends. Where are those friends now? I did not come with empty hands. We must speak about your options. Hanako Arasaka promised to save my life. It is the reason she sent me here. To discuss the alternative. Dead in a few months. That's me, huh? You will feel better at first, but then the illness will grow fierce, attack in full force. Your final weeks, you will spend in bed. Fuck. Please, feel no anger. I wish to speak You're about You're offering to put me in a different body, is that it? What are you talking about? Trusted you all once already. You let me down. You may join the Secure Your Soul program. Hanako Arasaka has agreed to it. You will leave your body. Arasaka will store your engram in Mikoshi until a way is found to no. transfer it to a new body. No. Store? Can't I get a new body right off? With technology as it is now, this is impossible. Did it with Seemed Saburo. pretty damn possible for Saburo Arasaka. He returned in his son's body. Tissue compatibility made things easier. Yet you have phenotype. Thanks to the chip, it's unique. Arasaka cannot provide a suitable body at this time. Sorry, not buying it. Arasaka's have to lock me up. You overstate your importance. To the Arasakas, I fear you are nobody. War nobody. With this offer, Hanako Arasaka rewards you generously for your service. There's not, as you say, more to the story. Yeah, I don't want to land in Makoshi. Nope. Doesn't sound good to me at all. I agree to this, and they'll do whatever they want with me. There will be a contract to protect you. Sign it, and you will live. No. No, Takamura, I'm not taking that contract. I don't want it. Please. I look at it. It is written here that you relinquish all rights, but do not worry. The law is simply behind the times, and Ingram is not legally a person. No. So I get to be corporate property first? Like many brain dance stars and politicians from what I know, the program is a success. There have been no complaints. And if I say no? This is not a prison. You will take your things and return to Night City. Why are you? I would say, but the choice is yours. Think it through carefully. Going home. Not signing it. No. Made my decision. Going back to Earth. Going home. You will die here. You're all right, Takamura. I like you. Thanks for coming all the way up here to help. But one thing you never understood, and never will. What is that? Got no idea how sweet it is to be free. You speak out of bitterness. Please reconsider. No. This here's goodbye. 
But I'm not gonna forget you. What we did together. Goodbye, V. Go home. A thing of beauty will never fade away. I see your eyes, I know you see me. You're like a ghost, how you're everywhere. Let's go home. Some view. the earth looking from way up there. She as pretty as they say? Or is that just another lie? Listen, don't forget, your implants were made for earth gravity. Could start acting up in orbit. What I'm trying to say is, don't ignore any arrow warnings, okay? And when you're back, I mean, if you come back, I'll do a full checkup. Maybe even give you a little discount. Take care, V. Hey, V. Everyone's telling me you're a, a base gordo now. A big shot, eh? <laughs> so big you can't call me once a week. Once a month, even. Don't forget where you started. who you started with, hmm? My door's always open to you. There's always food on my table. Mi casa es su casa. No se te olvide. Ahí te veo, Vi. Hey, V. Long time no see. Let me guess, you still the top of your game in all of Night City? <laughs> yeah, I left all that. I guess I'm just calling to say thanks for everything. It wasn't until I'd left everything behind that I realized how depressed I was for all that time. Take it from me, V. If you ever get the chance, just leave. Leave and don't look back. The weight it takes off your shoulders, I... I can't even describe it. All right. Enough lecturing. Take it easy, girl. Hello, V. How are things? Weather in the Badlands is pleasant as usual. My cooler melted, it's 90 degrees in the shade, and there's sandstorms heading straight for us. So yeah, you're missing out. No, but seriously. We're doing all right. Saul and I somehow get along, for better or for worse. But still, family's always growing, work's always piling up. But better to keep busy, right? And to think if it wasn't for you, I'd still be stumbling my way through Night City. So I just want to say thank you. For all you've done for me. 
I'd still be lost if you hadn't set me on the right track. All right, well, talk soon, V. Don't be a stranger. Hello, V. Um, Saul speaking. Heard about something big happening in Night City, with a certain V in the lead role. Uh, don't know what you plan to do now, but just remember, we always take care of our own. And, um, you're one of us now, V. You're an Alda Caldo. Remember that. Ah, take care of yourself, V. And see you around. V, hey! Can you hear me? Shit, is this thing recording? Okay, well, all of us have been wondering when you're finally gonna drop by. We can get a barbecue going, knock a few back, do a couple of races, or pay a friendly visit to the Raff and Shiv. Guess what I'm trying to say is, well, Badlands could use a badass like you, V. Don't know what you got on your plate right now, but remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now, take care. Hey, Rogue here. I wanted to... Oh, voicemail. <laughs> Why not? V? I was wondering if you could pass the message along to Johnny. Two messages, actually. One, that he's an arrogant, egotistical son of a bitch. And second, that it was nice to talk to him again. Both of you, take care of yourselves, okay? Hey, V, so funny thing just said- Oh, fuck, fuck, shit. Voicemail again. Do you ever answer the phone? Like, ever? Seriously. I can get through to data term customer service faster than you. <sighs> what did I even want? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that us cracks agent called me and asked if I would go on duo with them? At first, I was like, over my dead fucking body. But then I thought, hey, wait. I could actually be fine. So, I don't know. Well, there's the latest gossip for you, if you do care. Call me back when you can, eh? Okay? Bye! V, hey, hey. So, here's the thing. A couple fellas from the 5th Precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron. Sawed-offs, stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Orders from on up were to blow it all to the ground. But then I thought... Maybe there's a better way to use all this stuff for a good cause. I still remember what you did for us, for me and Randy. The city needs more people like you, but I'm gonna make sure they're equipped. This one's on me, V. See you around. Hello, V. From what I understand, you have less than six months to live. I do not know how you plan to spend this time. Perhaps you have chosen to put your feet up, rest, ponder life's meaning. Or perhaps you continue to do what you are good at. If that is the case, my father and I would gladly retain your services. You would be compensated generously. Six months will pass faster than you imagine. It would be a shame to let this time go to waste. Hey, V. Jefferson Perales here. You know, mayor of Night City. I'm calling about our recent program to tackle homelessness. What would you say about being the head of my security detail, huh? As you know, the number of people I can trust are few and far between. Next week, we're going to be raising the city's taxes. So, things might get a little hairy. Come by, we'll hammer out a good deal for you. I'm no any pincher when it comes to safety. All right, well, we'll be in touch, V. Hey, V. Orbital connections cost an arm and a leg, so I'll just get right to it. I was just thinking about you, so I laid out a quick tarot and... Oh, dear. The fool, the moon, 
the High Priestess. Those, uh, those are bad cards. Keep a close eye on your new friends, V. I mean it. <laughs>